Marcus, I'm going to start with you. 30 seconds on the clock. You guys are up three. You miss a couple critical free throws late from your guys there. But walk me through the communication that had to happen to win this one down the stretch. You know, the biggest thing was, man, just keep defending. It's the NBA. You're going to miss shots, but it got to be next possession. You know, guys did a great job of just moving on, rebounding down the stretch. And, you know, we played critical defense down that stretch right there. So, you know, I'm happy for the guys, happy to get this win and go home. And, you know, Frank, the physicality, the defense that he's talking about, what has Marcus Morris brought to this team this year in terms of what you guys need to do to start winning these games here? Uh, like you said, physicality, character. Uh, since day one, he, he brought that uh, training camp. And, uh, I mean, man, we've been competing, competing real hard uh, at practice. And today, we, we, it was successful. We brought it onto the court. So, thankful for that. Now we got to build on that. And, yeah, he brought that. And Marcus, this guy had his best game as an NBA player, no doubt. But how clutch was that? And how big was this win? Man, it was very clutch. You know, this guy, man, he getting better day in, day out, man. Practice, you know, being able to command a team, take control, being a vocal leader down the stretch of some big, big shots for us. Uh, you know, I'm excited for him, man. I'm excited for his growth. And, you know, we're just trying to keep it going. And Frank, of course, you picked a good time to get a great game tonight. And, of course, you faced Christoph Sprzingis, a couple of other former Knicks players. And I know you talked about how this wasn't that big of a deal, but I also saw you speaking to him at the end. What did it mean to get this win tonight for you? Uh, it means a lot. It means a lot. Once you, uh, when you're competing against your, I mean, friends, uh, you play harder on the court. Even if you play hard every day, you play harder on the court against your friends. And uh, uh, winning that game against them, it was, it was, it was good. Good feeling. Congrats to you both, guys. Thank you. What's the most satisfying thing about this win for you? Um, how we kept our composure down the stretch. You know, we were up and, you know, they made a run. Uh, what you expect them to do? They're a good team at home. But we kept our composure um, and closed the game down the stretch playing the right way. Defensively tonight, this team talked about getting back to that intensity, that physicality, and you brought that for 48 minutes. What did you see on that side? Uh, exactly, that's exactly what it was. You know, we had our coverages and schemes, but most of all, we got back into you know our physicality, getting into people, uh, finishing the possessions and rebounds. Uh, we struggled with that early in the game, but you know we locked back in it and we took away the transition for the most part. So um, it was a good job. Offensively, 61 points in the first half, and then a lot of clutch buckets in the second half. What did you see from Frank as a point guard tonight? Uh, he looked great. He made a lot of uh, you know, uh, tough shots um, down the straights, big shots. Um, and most of all, it was the confidence. You know, I love seeing that confidence out of Frank. You know, him coming out knowing he can make plays, knowing he can make shots. Uh, and then he's getting into the ball on the defense. We know what he does on that end. But uh, just his confidence as a player was amazing tonight. That rebound late there, you got him 30 seconds. How clutch was that for you guys and just kind of resetting the clock and being able to hit a few more? Uh, I mean, it's late clock like that. I got to go. You know, a lot, a lot of times I won't go uh, crash it or, you know, free throw offensive rebounds just to get back. Uh, but late clock like that, um, you know, I got to go. And, you know, I like my matchup most of the time, so. After how hard this team has been working to put together a, a, a complete game and after some of the losses that were just so tight, how did you guys grow from this one? How can you build from this when you see now the work pay off? Uh, we just got to keep coming in the games with the same mindset. You know, we got to know our identity uh, and not put so much pressure on ourselves. You know, um, on this road trip, I just said I want to have fun. You know, regardless of, you know, results or what happens, I just want to have fun. I think if we go out there and have fun, I put pressure on ourselves, just go out there and play free. Uh, keep pushing our pace like we're doing and like we did today, got back into our physicality on the defensive end. Uh, we won a lot of games. You don't have Mitchell Robinson. You step in and get stuff done on both ends of the floor. What was your approach? Just do whatever the team needs. Um, I work with Mitch every day and uh, I, I was already feeling kind of uh, sick just knowing that he puts in a lot of work and puts in a lot of effort and practice. And to go down like that, we really uh, needed him and we really could use him tonight. And I was just thinking next man up, uh, just being professional, just trying to do anything I could do to help the team. You've won plenty in this league. You've seen it all. You've done it all. But for the young players, how big is a win like this win tonight? <sighs> it's a big win. You know what I'm saying? Uh, 
the way we were moving the ball, the way we were playing together, um, we, we showed signs of a good team, a uh, team growing up in uh, different aspects of the game. Uh, we got some things we got to shore up, but uh, when you come on, come on to the West Coast and get a win on a hostile environment, especially playing against a hot team like that, uh, it, it's, good for my, it's good for our momentum and it's good for our morale in here. And, um, it's good for the young fellas to just learn from it and build on to the next game.